Is do you know what day it is today? Uh your birthday? No, man. It's the first day of the month. Oh, I know. Isn't it great? I've been looking forward to today's day for ages. <laughs> Ace, the first day of the month means you and I sit together and we come up with a budget. Okay? How else are we going to save for my car? But we don't have to do it now, no? Yes, we do. Baby, kickoff starts in 30 minutes. I need to go and buy groceries this afternoon and I'm not going to the mall without a budget. Baby, you've always been the bad cop who controls our finances. And I'm the good hustler who likes to spend. So why don't you put the handcuffs on me and tell me what to do? <laughs> hey, man. Because you're my husband, not a criminal. We need to look into our finances together. And how would we do that? Well, you can start by telling me what you spent your money on last month. Hmm? I can't remember. Yeah, you can. Oh, hang on. I have a few slips. Okay, go through them then and make two piles. One for the essentials and another one for your little extras. The bunny chows and the lotus. Baby, how did you know about the bunny chows? Yes, <laughs> the evidence is right here. <laughs> and once you're done, draw up a list of all the other expenses that you can think of. Ne? You won't believe it. Ayanda has been invited to the metric dance with Pimelo. My metric dance? And she says her mom is going to buy her a dress in Santa. That does it. I'm getting the hottest number in the shops and I don't care what it costs. So you're going to waste money just to make Ayanda jealous? That is so dumb. I know you live on a tight budget because your mom is unemployed, Figile. But right now, I don't need your money advice. I'm prioritizing hotness. But Bali, be realistic. You need to set aside some cash for other things like varsity application fees. I forgot about that. Last month, my mom went for a job interview. She didn't have anything to wear. So she made herself this really stunning skirt for only eight rands. Big ups to your mom, but I, I can't sew. Well, I can sew, so work out how much you can afford for fabric and I'll help you make the dress. Something's making you angry. It's your mother. She's trying to make me cut back on my little extras. And how little are we talking? No more bunny chows. It's not too bad. Less beer, less airtime, and no more paying speaker to wash my car. Wow, she's really making you tighten up your belt. Well, at least you'll be saving and lose a little bait of weight while you add. I need to borrow some money. I can't do without my little extras. Cool, but just so you know, for every 10 rand you borrow, I'm gonna charge you five rand more. Oh, uh, well, man, what type of a child are you? I didn't raise you to become a loan shark. I've gotta protect my wallet now. Spusu told me about your conversation. It was a great idea to budget, but uh, the reality of it is something else. I know, but I don't want you to go and borrow money and get into debt because of the little extras. But I have no choice. I tell you what, maybe we must sit down and relook at this budget together. Maybe we'll find a way of getting you a little extra money each week. For my little extras? Yes, it won't be a lot, but it will help you ease your pain.